It's Chris with City Girl Homestead. And who are you? Bye, Tom. <laughs> well, now you're doing hi, Tom. Because oh, hi, Tom. Okay. Just wait. Don't get don't get off. Oh, put it in there. <laughs> we were going to do a live tonight, but we thought it might be better to schedule it. So next week, I think I've got it figured out. Um, we're going to go do a live with you guys. So It may be Memorex. I'm not sure. Oh my god. Are you ready? Here we go. Not yet. We aren't even told them what we're making yet. Oh, we're making meatloaf. Well, what kind of meatloaf? Cupcake meatloaf. <laughs> Put on a cupcake pan. It's cupcake meatloaf, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so now, wait a minute. We have to tell people what you're doing. Well, I can see it. I got a hamburger in my hand. I'm going to dump it in the bowl. But how much is there? Two pounds? Two pounds of hamburger. Okay, so put two pounds of hamburger. <laughs> there, two pounds of hamburger in the hole. There we go. That's right. us. Next. What's next? We got stuffing with chicken. Chicken stove top. Stick and stove top. Mm -hmm. So we're going to sprinkle that in here like got to pour it in there. Oh, I'm going to do it like cereal. Yeah. <laughs> That ain't a big enough bowl for your cereal. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. Whatever. Okay. Now you need two eggs. Two eggs. I'm gonna fold them. <laughs> Doesn't work. I right, gotta go over here. Yeah. Oh Jesus! That did not work quite like a plan. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> Make sure you didn't get any um eggshells in there. No shells. Okay, do the second one. And you guys wonder why I do the cooking? <laughs> that was so precious, Tom. You did such a great job. I didn't squeeze it that time. Everybody say yay for Tom. Yay for Tom. Now you're going to, nope. You're going to use a cup of water. Oh, I was going to get a spoon of syrup. Ah, uh, nicer. <laughs> Tom doesn't like to play with his food either. And by the way, Tom went in and scrubbed his hands really good before he did this. And he's like, why I got am I doing this? got surgical hands now. <laughs> he's like, why am I doing this? Because I said, you're going to play with your food. I don't want to play with my food. Nobody can see you now. Well, I can't help it. I can't see the bowl if I don't. Okay, we'll see your big gully belly for a bit. That's right. Yeah. Let's suck it in. Yeah. Will you? Amber, <laughs> <laughs> kind of cold. It is. Yeah. Make sure you mix it really, really good. Oh, yeah. Is that like concrete, too? No, this is more consistency of... Uh, <laughs> of what? I'm not sure yet. Okay. What do you think about it? He has potatoes over there on a <coughs> low... Gooey. A low cook, because he's going to actually make mashed potatoes tonight, too. And not from a bag. Straight from a potato. <laughs> you know, the better you get at this, the more often you can cook. Oh, no, 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 no contraire. <laughs> Why not, Tom? I'm learning how to survive in the wilderness. <laughs> Surviving in the wilderness, huh? Yep, I want to go off grid. And... I would like to do that, you know that, right? Raise myself a couple of beef, get a male and female so we can grow calves between the times. So once the one's ready, okay. then we can have another one, and then another one, and then another one. Yeah. Don't you you sound like Christopher anymore? right now. Everything needs to breed. My son, when he was little, he thought everything had to breed. So we bred fish. We bred, I don't know what else, hamsters. Oh, Lord. And now he's on his own. He does uh, chickens, and he did ducks. quail for a while. He does and ducks. Turkeys. And turkeys, yeah. He get turkey following around like a little puppy dog. <laughs> I want to get that. Um, you got it together? Let me see. It shouldn't yeah, take this long to mix it. I'm mixing it good. Okay. Look, that would have been good. <laughs> oh, get back here. I'm not supposed to be getting my hands dirty. Well, that's your thing. You might want to grab that towel right behind you. We don't need to punch our meat. 
Okay, we don't need to punch the meat. I want to be like Stallone. No. <clears throat> all right, all right. Okay. Grab that towel behind you so you can wipe your hands off. Uh, 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 I have to live with us, too. Come on, Tom, just rub it good. That's gooey, yeah. He said earlier, you know, if you make your videos longer, you could get more watch time. And I'm like, yeah, and then people don't want to watch that long. So he's taking his time. Because he had to play with his food. I like playing with Taking food. the towel away, taking the towel away. All right. All right, so have a seat so people can see your pretty face. Uh, yeah, because I got a haircut and everything. Yeah, he got a haircut today so he doesn't look like a shaggy dog anymore. So now the next thing we're going to do is spray this pan really, really good. Because if it's not, it makes a big mess. Guess who's cleaning it up? Her. No, no, no. That's no. not how that works. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I know. Uh, you wash them, I put them on. Not when you make a mess like that. No, I get to roll these up in a little roly-poly. Yeah, not that big, Tom. They got to fit in there. That's still too big, see? You don't want to... No, it's not. No, it's not. You got to get 12 of them out of there. Oh, well, good more 12 there. You can always add later. Not so much. Whoops, I can't see it. Let's put this down a little bit. There we go. So now they can see what you're doing. That one's good. Way too full. Still too full. And then you're going to have to roll it back in a ball. Because if you don't, guess what will happen? Nope, you got to pull it back up, honey. Because if you don't... What? That's still too full. If you don't, then your meat will all fall apart. Do you want that? No. Okay, so you know you got too big of a piece already, right? Well, i got big hands to kill this one. <laughs> yeah, see? That's much better. <laughs> now, I had a gentleman that he's single. He's an older gentleman, and he talked about, you know, um, he eats a lot of frozen dinners. So, I told him I would do meals for one. But honestly, one of the reasons we're doing it in this is for him. Because you can eat how many ever you're going to eat that one day, and then you can package up your leftovers plus your mashed potatoes into a freezable container and then make your own frozen food. Your tongue's still in your mouth. That's a good thing. Stop it. <laughs> when he's really in deep in thought, his tongue comes out of his mouth. Like, you can't think unless his tongue's out of his mouth. I got on Channel 10 News one time that way. Yes, yeah, you did. My buddy says, I know that tongue anymore. That's Tom. I know it is. And I go, <laughs> he goes, called me up on the phone. He says, was that you on Channel 10? I go, yeah. He says, I told you I could know that tongue anywhere. He says, oh, Lord. How's it coming here, honey? One step in a time. Must be jelly, it don't shake like that. Boop. <sighs> yeah. I still ain't figured out what the consistency is. Nine minutes and you still haven't finished. Oh, see there? That's a watch time. See? <laughs> Everybody likes to watch me cook, see? There. I'm pretty good at this. Yeah, you are. I made a good shot at that one. See, I just threw it over there. Watch this one. This one's over the shoulder. No, you're not doing that. I'm doing over the shoulder shot here. No, right. you're not right. doing that. Right. No. Right. If you do that, you're going to die. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's so good. Yeah, you are, honey. Oh, that one there, not quite so good. Not mixing up very well. I gotta put it together a little bit. Because more. you didn't mix your stuff together very I well. I did too. I mushed it in with my hands like no tomorrow. Oh, well, there's still some pieces that weren't mixed together very good. Now, how much is left over? 
Why don't you take a couple of these small ones and add two of them? Take it out. Them are the ones you did, see. No. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> you play the blame game here, mister. No, I won the blame game. That were the two you get. It wasn't or wasn't not the ones he oh did. Oh my god. You, you answer that when we get to that next check, Tennessee. I'm pretty sure those two are yours. Oh. We're not live, so they can't answer. Well, they might answer later. Well, they will, but I won't tell you. Oh, how that works. <laughs> okay. See? It's Memorex. Poor Tom. Well, that one's way too big. Look at that. Yeah, why don't you add a little bit to maybe this one over here? That's the other one you made. Yes, Tom. Here, I'll add a little more to it. That one's going to be horrible when you try to take it out. Nah. Okay. I'll mix it Is that all the hamburger? Most of it. You can put a little bit more on that one. Oh. Tom loves meatloaf, so hopefully there's enough left for his lunch tomorrow. Don't wipe your hands off now. Oh, I gotta get rid of that hamburger first. <sighs> Now, you guys can do the topping several of different ways. You can, you know, do just ketchup. You can do ketchup with um, brown sugar, or you can do barbecue sauce. But, Tom, we don't want to make it too difficult. Stop playing with it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right, ketchup, shake it up. You're going to make it so it doesn't want to come out, silly. You don't want it watery, so shake it really good. There you go. There you go. We're going to flatten these out just a little bit. Okay, I'm sure that's good enough. I'm sure that's good enough. And you guys wonder why I have patience with Jack. <laughs> now you're just doing a topping, honey. There you go. I'm going to let you do a spoon to decorate it. I've never seen this done with the... Um, Stove top, so I'm really curious how good that turns out. Look at you, you're an artist. You're a meatloaf artist. Amazing. Oh, Lord. <laughs> you're going to mess it up anyway. All right, so now you're going to take your spoon like this and kind of just run it over the top of all of them. There you go. We really don't need watch hours that badly, Tom. We don't want to watch paint dry. Anyways, we're going to put this in the oven. <laughs> um, about 30 minutes, and then we'll check it and see how they're doing. And by then, maybe we'll be done, and, and uh, Tom can actually use the hand mixer and do mashed potatoes. Ooh. So let's not encourage him Dude, more you're here. Gonna make me, you're not going to make me do it by hand? No. He took my smiley face away. I know. Oh, and there it goes. My smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back, you guys. Alrighty, so we're back. So now Tom's going to take and make some... Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. My favorite. He does love his mashed potatoes. How much milk? One cup? You just pour a little bit in. Okay. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Well, you never know. Right. One spoon, two spoons of butter. All right, little, grab your little garlic. And... Cord's too short. <laughs> I'm scared right now. I'm gonna stand up. Yeah. Okay. We want to turn it up a little bit. Please. 
Remember, it's salt. Does that look like a regular cup? I don't know about you, Tom. We'll see how good it is. So we'll stir that into it. Believe me, it'll be really yummy. All right, you guys. We're going to put all this on the table, get our plates set, and we'll see how Tom did. All righty, Tom. There's what he made. Oh. Cupcake meatloaf. Mm. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. If it wasn't so hot, I'd grab it like a cupcake and eat it. <laughs> Just eat your food. It's just like a cupcake. It does. <laughs> Try some of your mashed potatoes. With my garlic salt on it? Yep. Mm. So how good did you do? I did wonderful. Kahuna I'm approved. I'm a good cook. <laughs> Kahuna approved. You gotta approve what you make, right? Well, if it's crap, it's crap, then, you know. But I take it's not crap. I think it's rather yummy. Good. So everybody in the comments below, let us know how Tom did. Goodbye, Tom. Bye, Tom. Everybody have a wonderful night. and Be a blessing to someone.